Hello friends, it's Samantha over here and you are watching the electric guy. In today's video I will talk about the basics of vero board and breadboard. Let's first talk about the breadboard. In a breadboard, these horizontal rails are connected to each other. And in this type of rail, the vertical rails are connected to each other. If I have to connect a capacitor with a resistor, how would I be able to connect? Let's see. To connect it, you have to connect one point of the capacitor to one rail, other to other point of the rail. Now, if I have to connect the positive side of capacitor to the resistor, I have to connect to this rail, this horizontal layer, like this. And now, the connection with the capacitor to the resistor is done in this way. An important thing is that it doesn't require any soldering. So it is very easy to use and it is used actually to test the circuit first and then solder it in this vero board. Okay, in this vero board we have to actually solder the connections like if I connect this capacitor to a point and now I have to connect the resistor to the capacitor positive I have to solder these two joints to actually make a connection but there are some vero boards which have breadboard layout but then also you require to solder the things on this board if you like my video please subscribe